You know, if you're looking for personal growth advice on the internet, it's dangerous because you can get extremely complicated advice, ranging from these really elaborate rituals to do every day, I've been guilty of that, to really, really, really in-depth goal setting and tracking these rituals that take a lot of time. But I think fundamentally, my response to the question, how do I change my life, begins with a very simple exercise you can do right now. Hey guys, Alex Hine, author of the self-growth book, Master the Day. Now I've included a free link down there below in the description, which is for a free journaling worksheet that you can use to reinvent your life and plot the path forward into building really an incredible quality of life. So you can check it out right there, the first link below. So I mean, fundamentally, to change your life means you have to change something you do every day, right? But where does that begin and how do you do that? I mean, if you decide that you're going to be the first person in your family that goes to law school and gets a graduate degree and no one else has in your family even gone beyond high school, how do you do that? I mean, that's a monumental task. They may not even believe in you or think that it's possible. And you may not even think it's possible. If you're the only person in your family or of your friend group that wants to be fit and everyone's overweight, how do you overcome that obstacle? when you see no one who's done that. Or if you wanna write a book about your difficult life story and you don't know a single author, how do you possibly begin sowing the seeds for that to happen? Now, if you've read my book, Master of the Day, you know I talk about what I observe to be the two most fundamental things to change the direction of your life. You have to change the story, the narrative as I call it, which is just whatever's happening up here regarding that part of your life. Whatever story you're telling about weight loss, or about setting goals, or about going to grad school. And then you obviously have to change something about your daily rituals and your daily habits. But even before the story, there is something still smaller. And that smaller thing, that seed, is the intention to change. Nobody loses 50 pounds without the intention to change. No one goes to medical school as the first person in their family without the intention to go to medical school. You don't accidentally get in. No one accidentally become super successful without the intention to, I want to live an exceptional quality of life. The intention precedes everything else in your life regarding goal setting and achievement. You know, it's cheesy, but it actually works. Just the very fact of waking up in the morning and saying or writing five times, today, my intention, my goal is to do X, Y, Z differently will really make a difference in the direction of your life forever. And I wanna share a quick daily practice that you can start doing because it really helped me, especially during the tough times. So for me, the daily practice begins in the morning because you wanna start the intention at the beginning of the day so that you're constantly remembering it throughout the day. So the intention could simply be, my intention today is I've always been a serious person. I'm just gonna smile a little bit more today or smile when I meet people and I'm gonna say their name. My intention today, when I get my morning coffee at that corner coffee shop on the way to work, I'm gonna get a healthier breakfast choice. That's fruit instead of the 800 calorie muffin. My intention today, yes, even as a quiet introvert, is I'm gonna go chat up one girl that looks pretty or interesting because I don't wanna be single anymore and I wanna find a girlfriend. And I know this sounds cute and trite and hippie woo woo crap, but it's shocking how well it works. When you say in the morning, my intention today is to live my life differently in this way. When you're in that scenario, you're actually going to find that you really do change your action. You really do behave differently and it really will get you different results. So I challenge you today, if you are looking to change one of the quadrants of your life, you really need to work on something. Set an intention in the morning. Just say, my goal today is to do this differently. This is what I'm going to do. And you'd be surprised by how much happens. So again, if you want help with that, check the free link in the first description link there below. It's for a free journaling worksheet that you'll get via email on how to reinvent your life and plot a path going forward for the most incredible life imaginable. You can check it out down there below. And then before you go, I have two related videos on this exact topic right on over here. (laughs) 